think that a lot of people don't know very much about electric vehicles. Um, we find in our surveys that people just, their knowledge base is, is very low. So they think that um, that they still run on gasoline or, or they think the other extreme of, you know, they only go 20 miles or, you know, they'll run out of charge. Um, so I think that we're at a pretty introductory level still for, for EVs. So I think that there's interest in our surveys. We certainly find that. We found that over a third of people are, are interested and would consider one um, in the next two years. Um, but vehicle EV sales are still fairly low, um, as as we all know. And even though they are growing, um, they still make up a, a small percentage of the market. And I think a lot of that has to do with what I was saying before about vehicle class, that most of the EVs being offered are the smaller vehicles that people are moving away from. And so as we're seeing more EV options in larger vehicle classes, um, people will be able to have the benefits of EVs with the kinds of vehicles they're looking for. So while people may not be able to want to make the trade off of going to a much smaller vehicle, um, you know, with limited range, having a vehicle that goes 200, 300, 400 miles on one charge and has all the convenience and size that they're used to, that's a much different uh, value proposition. So that's going to change very quickly in the next couple of years based on what automakers have said they're going to bring to market.